Previously on Dance Academy. All I want is just a nice, simple crush. Just, just stop. Well, you know what? I'm gonna like you if I wanna like you, but there's nothing you can do about it. Fine. Like me then. Fine. I will. I'm not doing this dance. Darling, you're just tired and you are run down. No doubt from rehearsing that ridiculous musical. It's not ridiculous. And it makes me happy. I know what makes you happy. I have sacrificed everything for your happiness. Finn, hi, it's me. Um, you're gonna have to find a replacement. Just rehearsals were interfering too much. This is for the teachers at the academy for always overlooking me. And that's for my dad. I'm in the Nationals of the Prix de Fontaine. Book a ticket. It's here, after nine months of training and agonizing over our solos, the national finals of the Prix de Fontaine. Judgment Day. Only two girls and two boys out of the entire country will make it through to the internationals. And the worst part, that all of our technique, our artistry, our individuality. The judges take these hard-earned things and transform them into cold, unforgiving numbers. Grace Whitney, National Academy, Classical Round. 7.7. 7.7. .7. Seven point six. Six point nine. Eight point nine. Thank you, Michael Slade, Tasmanian School of Dance. The Slade is spoken. Beat that. We care about the students, the but they hate oh, us. It's, it's rigged. It's ridiculous. Just, just calm down. Zach, we're not seven. Whoa, you might be, but we're not. What? We're playing favorites. Uh, ben, you're over here. It's rigged. Enough! It's not... I agree you've been marked harshly, but there's no excuse for whining. Are we keeping you, Miss Armstrong? I will be making inquiries with the committee as to whether there is bias involved. As the National School, we enjoy certain privileges. It can work against us. However, that's not your concern. You are going to suck it up and focus on the contemporary round tomorrow. There he is. Hi. Mum's at a conference. We thought we could be your fan base. Uh, you guys just, you went at the theatre just then, were you? Sorry, I got stuck at the hospital. But you're on again tomorrow, right? Sorry, stock book update. 6.9. No one. Yeah, in. Ollie, this is my dad. Wow, the famous Dr. <laughs> Lieberman. So it didn't go so well today. I'm sure his girlfriend made him feel better. Ari. I checked relationship status too. Listen, why don't we do lunch tomorrow? Before you perform, you can invite this girl along. Yeah, that's, yeah that sounds really, um, that's really good. Um, look, I've got to get changed though, so. 
I'll call you. Okay. All right. Lunch with the family, and you change the status. This is getting serious. Look, you, you can't come to theatre tomorrow because we might keep up vibes. My family's not like yours, okay? My mum would cry, dad would just blame ballet. Right. And his opinion counts because he's always been so supportive. but we are just, like, devoid of all choreography skills. Okay, so are you going to do both roles now? Yeah, yours and mine. It's a, a Jekyll and Hyde acting challenge. Fan, look who heard the distress signal. Uh, I told you we don't need any help. That is just a lie. <laughs> it's okay. He thinks I'll let you down. I got the voicemail. <laughs> I couldn't have done it anyway now that it's opening tomorrow night. It's a direct clash with the Nationals, so... Yeah, I know, darling. And he gets it, and so do I. Super prestigious ballet competition trumps unpaid fringe musical every time. <laughs> that Slade kid needs taken down. The headband's got you rattled. It's you I'm worried about. Nothing is going to psych me out tomorrow. That's why I'm beating you. Oh, OK. How'd you call? So if I reminded you that I beat you in the preliminaries, that wouldn't be unsettling? I was luring you into a false sense of security. And that girl you like, I'm with now? Cat. She's so six months ago. And plus, it's her ex who thinks I'm hot. She loses her way sometimes. Hey, Tara. Want to go to the beach? Now? Have you been? It's training. Good. I wouldn't worry about those judges. They'll be eating their scorecards when you win the international. Have you thought about where you want your scholarship to be? No, I um, didn't want to jinx myself. I've always thought, picture New York. We'll get an apartment near Lincoln Center. You'll be in the company by the time you're 18. A soloist by 21. Principal <laughs> by the time you're 24. All gonna happen for you, sweetheart. Excuse me. Can I borrow you for a second? Yes. Um, sorry, Mum. Kate, all you gotta do is shoot me adoring looks and and if I say something witty, be like, oh, Sammy, you're such a character. A sane person would just say, No, Dad, I don't have a girlfriend. Yes, but he's expecting one. And if I can smooth just this one situation, you know? As my entire life has become about pleasing other people, why not? It's so sweet of you to do this. It really puts stuff in perspective. Do you reckon you could eat this raw? Like, sushi style? Perspective, like, remember how a couple of weeks ago I said I wasn't Ready to go out for anyone? Vaguely. So, if it makes a difference, I think I'm past that. Um, okay, look. The problem is, there's like a friend ladder and a girlfriend ladder. And you can move up and down these ladders, but you just can't cross from one ladder to another. And I'm on the friend ladder. Close to the top, but yeah. Got it. <laughs> this was where we left our stuff, right? Have we been robbed? <sighs> Who steals from people in the middle of an important competition? Slade. I would not put it past him. Somebody! Elite athletes in distress! We can walk. Trust me, I've done it before. Sample of friends can become a sample of strangers. 
Nationals, to avoid any disputes about influence, fictional or otherwise, the judging panel will keep their scores private. Results will be announced at the end of competition today. Benjamin Tickle, National Academy. Don't hurt yourself. Tea. That must have been some seaside adventure. We're on the friends ladder. Yeah, no, he didn't just look at you like a friend. I guess I just stick to neutral topics. Like the weather, Sydney traffic. Look, let's just abort. You obviously want to be backstage. Too late. Sammy. Hey, Dad. Ari. This is Abigail, my girlfriend. It's my girlfriend, Abigail. Now, this is Dad. This is Ari you've met. Leave him in. Abigail. Hi. It's a lovely day. Hi. Is traffic OK? Yeah, it was fine. Thanks. Shall we eat? Yeah. Yeah. Incredible, isn't he? Maybe ask him why he's suddenly all over you. Because he's enchanted by her winsome charms. He's trying to psych me out. Really? I'm so hideous that no one would ever like me unless there's an agenda. And why, pray tell, would it psych you out, boyfriend? That's the thing, it wouldn't. Just don't get hurt, okay? Ignore him. The competition is warping his brain. Don't be nervous on my account. I don't expect anything today. Just seeing how my money's spent. <laughs> Just making sure you're not wasting it. So how, um, how bad do you think I'm going to be today exactly? Honey, tone warning. Sammy, I'm just trying to make conversation. Yeah. I mean, how would you know what to say to me? You know, when we're basically strangers. Hmm? Sorry. He's just a little temperamental. Excuse me. What are you doing? Did you hear that? No matter how I do, I'm a disappointment regardless. I, I can't, I can't do it, okay? I'm out. Okay, I can't get up there and try and prove him right. You pushed me in the garden. You were irritating me. You need to stop complaining about your dad's low expectations. Do you have any idea what I would give for low expectations? And who cares if he doesn't think you're good? You're not dancing in that competition because of him. Right, okay, so why am I dancing then? Huh? that's where you want to be, more than anywhere else. You want to be on that stage doing what makes you happy. out the back so we didn't give off vibes. Oh, I could sort of use your side stage instead. I'm sorry. No. I'm just happy I'm so well adjusted compared to you. 
So I'm thinking, if anyone was to have the skillage to cross ladders, it'd be you. How would that work? Well, um, the ladders, they would, they would have to be pretty close. And then if, if you just leaned over, or I could. Next to the stage, Christian Reed, the National Academy. Tell me you didn't just do that to mess with Christian. What? No. I mean, asking you to the beach was, it was, it was a tactic. But it, it didn't end like that. Stop it was... talking. His crush, or whatever it was, is officially over. What is going on with him? There's a boy lurking when we're off to New York. <laughs> Broken eyelash from in Misty. Who's that? Oh, those musical theatre people. How sweet. Right. Mum? Mm hmm? I have to go. Sit down, please. I need to get your makeup done. Come on. Right. I know how much you want this. And you could be right, I might win the pre. But I might not. Things, I don't care either way. Sweetheart, it's just the nerves talking, just relax. No, Mum, listen. I'm not dancing today. I can't breathe. Oh, don't. I can't breathe. Mum, I can't be responsible for making you breathe. That's not my job. Sweetheart. Once again, this lady is superior. Not with that headband. Samuel Lieberman, National Academy. How about, how about we make this an immersive experience and you guys just imagine the music?
It's usually less bumpy. <laughs> I've never seen anything like it. We didn't get to finish our lunch. Do you think you could come home soon? You too, Ollie. You're welcome anytime. There's this argument that there shouldn't be competitions in ballet. Because it's an art, not a sport. The following four dancers will be representing Australia in the international round of the Prix de Fontaine. But competition brings out the best in some people. For others, it crystallizes what's important to them. so touchy-feely. The part I don't like is ranking everyone best to worst. In the girls section, the silver medal is awarded to Grace Whitney, National Academy. But I might just be saying that right now to prepare myself for disappointment. And the gold medal goes to Tara Webster, also from National Academy. In the boys' section, the silver medal goes to Michael Slade, Tasmanian School of Dance. which um, he'll collect later. And the gold medal is awarded to Samuel Lieberman, National Academy. Presidente.